I'm always interested in, in sort of seeing if I can find lesbian ghosts. We're lesbians too, and we have the car right there. If any of you would like to join us in the car now, you can come with us. I think it feels really impressive in here. Massive readings. We decided that it was weird that we always assumed that ghosts are heterosexual. Were you romantically involved with a woman? Wow. The places that most ghosts are found, we were the people in those places. All the nameless beings that have gone before us that have dared to love. We were just wondering if you were one of them. You don't have to be afraid. You can just tell us. They were never able to, to tell their story. Be their true self. Telling it now, maybe that helps them. Did you have to keep it a secret? Wow. That's some tough stuff. I'm sorry. That ghost came out that night. And we all know about the power of coming out. And where you are, it probably feels like eternity. We're really here to connect with them beyond just proving their existence. So. <laughs> oh, oh, Jesus oh, Christ. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna oh, die. Oh, 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 oh. Well, it came from that way. Oh, look at the whole perfect <laughs> Look at that. Are you attracted to Scott? That's a yes. It's a hard <laughs> <laughs> Well, thank you. I'm actually very flattered. It's not just the ghost aspect of it. For me, it's, it is the history. And if we don't have them written down physically, the only other way is to communicate with those who experienced it firsthand. Yes, yeah, so what was the sodomy situation? Because no one's ever tried to specifically look for these people before. They were just lost. So the situation... <laughs>